All right, welcome to Smokey Reacts. I'm your boy, Journalist, and on this one, we are here to do some more shits and gigs. Shout out to the boys over there. This one is uh, She's the Villain, A-I-T-A. I don't know what that is. Uh, there. So, yeah, let's check this one out. Thank you guys for joining me. If you could, please hit that like, subscribe, Patreon's in the description. Let's get into this. We're gonna finish on my so Yeah, damn, I forgot I've got that oh as well. Oh god, that made me laugh. I'm black, 15 male, that goes to a school full of whites. By the way, I'm in year 10. I've been there, blood. So there's this boy that is in year 11 that used to go to my old school, black boy. <clears throat> once we both found out, we be once we both found that out, we became friends. And long story short, I ended up signing him off. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he gotta be joking. What? <laughs> What? <laughs> That's not a long story short. What? How we get here? <laughs> when I clicked on this shit today, I didn't expect this. I don't even know what the fuck we get into now. What the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> bro, bro. Whoa, bro. Yo. <laughs> That escalated. <laughs> it, did, it did, it did. Wow, okay, carry on. Yeah, me. Um, I ended up him off. It's not that I like him or anything, and we are still friends that chat the same before it happened, huh? And we're still friends, and we, we chat, chat the, the same, same before. before it happened, and everything stayed the same. Now, there's this one black girl that I'm so-called friends with, uh, let's call her Gemma, that's just too much. Nobody can stand her. She's loud for no reason draws attention to herself, etc. Ever since she joined the school, she's been going back to back with the guys in the school. On the first day, she said she would give head to two boys in our year. Since then, she's been pushing herself into them and lying on their name. For example, one of my close male friends got stuck in the middle with her. She lied saying that he grabbed her bum uh, when what really happened is that she tried to force him to grab her bum. So yeah, so today, the day I'm writing this, she said that the boy I gave Briz to her three times. <laughs> I don't know why, but that was the last straw. <laughs> what is this? I don't want to chat to her no more. The I forgot to move the screen. Boy, I gave Briz to. <laughs> Briz, you know, <laughs> wow, <laughs> Brizzy. That's the that's the new what one. What is this? What is this? <laughs> See that Brizzy? <laughs> Man said that was the last, last straw. straw. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to chat to her no more. We're on half term, so I don't have to see her for a week. Am I the answer for wanting to cut her off when I when there is a slight chance she could be telling the truth? Um, and that's it. Let me let me. So do does a, he chat mm. to her for any other reason than the fact that she's black? Maybe not, bro. Because he's yeah, because he's not said a single positive yeah, word about her this yeah. entire time. But well, then again, it's we've not we don't know his account. His account of the girl. Yeah. yeah, this is a girl. So this is a girl saying, "You going up?" I thought it was a guy the no, whole this time. This is a girl. Oh my god! That was just me. I swear, like oh god, I was right there with James. I was like, this escalated, bro. Like you just I knew my man then from the last school. Just sucked them off. I had what? How is that a long story short? Fam, this is, what, this is when you said I ended up sucking. Did you think it was a guy? Yeah, I thought the exact same thing. I thought you said male at the start. 15 male. 15 female. Did you hear male? I thought you said male. I wrote Did that I male. That I thought he said Yeah, there. bro, you said oh, male. Yeah, yeah. My bad. My, this I, whole time, that's what I said. Long story short, I ended up sucking him off. It was a guy, son of a guy, bro. Oh, no, sorry, sorry. I genuinely thought I said that's female. That's why I laughed so hard. I genuinely thought I said female. Wow. Okay, 15 male. <laughs> my bad. 15 female. I said it again. 15 oh, female. Bro, my bad. bro. Uh, my bad. My exact bad. Same thing. Oh, that's jokes. My I, was bad, like, my I don't bad. even like him or anything. I was like, wow. My escalated. All right, say that. 15 female. That's still crazy. Goes to school full of whites. Um, she is in year 10. There's another black boy in year 11. Long story short, she sucked him off. Um, they're not really friends or anything. Um, it's just because they happen to have good chat or whatever. Yeah, 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 black. yeah, yeah. Uh, Another and black girl, <clears throat> another black girl joined who they're f who she's friends with, um, but nobody could really stand her. She's too loud and blah, blah, blah. She And she lies on people's names. Um, she said the first day that she apparently gave head to two other boys. We don't know if it's true or not. 
and she's um, also saying that she, that the boy she gave Riz to- Banged her three times. Banged this other girl three times, well, we, but again, we don't know. Yeah, she yeah, said, yeah. she said, that's it, I'm not putting up with this anymore. Not, it's the last straw. I'm gonna cut her off. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna cut her off. She's saying, is she the asshole um, to cut her off the first chance he gets, considering there's a slight chance she might be telling the truth. I'll cut her off anyway. Mm. Even if she is telling the truth, she yeah. sounds hectic. She sounds Facts. hectic and toxic. She sounds like she wants to be center of attention, considering she is one of three maybe black people in the yeah, hospital. Yeah, I don't see anything positive come from this friendship. <clears throat> yeah. So I would just cut yeah, it. Yeah. I will say though, one of my best friends, like now probably I'm honestly my best friend in the world is somebody who, not this exact dynamic, but just like being one of the only like black kids in the school at the time. And then like, just like, feeling like they weren't moving how I wanted them to move and feeling like they did shit outside of how I would want them to operate really made me kind of like shun that like relationship. But now like they are truly my best friend and like I'm thankful that like I've had that, uh, I guess like full circle relationship with this person. So I would say, I don't know if anybody from this scenario will ever fucking see this, but like I would say just in general, yeah, cutting people off is great. I'm a I will cut a motherfucker off, family or friend. ASAP. Motherfucker, you got to go. But I do try and be measured with when I do decide to actually cut you off because if I do decide, I've actually taken the time to think about it because sometimes you never know. You might be cutting off somebody that could be, truly be one of your best friends. And I think about that quite often cuz the homie that is like, "Ah, oh, that's my dog. That's my dog." I was like, "Fuck." I used to hate that nigga, but that's my dog now. Uh, yeah, it's yeah. also one of the, it's, it's crazy because the way my brain works is like, this is like me and girls territory and you're the only two black girls in a school. So if you're not brethren, yeah. there's gonna be allies for one black yeah, girl and allies yeah, for yeah, another yeah, black yeah, girl. It yeah, just, yeah, yeah, yeah. the optics it's looks just, mad. Race wars, Yeah, bro. the optics looks mad and no one else black is backing you. Do you know 100%. how mad that is? 100%. Yeah, unless a new new black person comes in and yeah, they're gonna have to, have to pick for, sides, have to bro. fight for that attention. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all long. It is long. So I can see the social pressure to mm. be her brethren. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I can yeah. see the social pressure, but yeah. she's hectic. Yeah. She's grabbing man's hand and making her squeeze her body. Bum. And then running her mouth saying, squeeze my ass, he squeeze my ass. I have to cut you off. Yeah, I have yeah. to. That's, um, Too that's problematic. Scary. Too much that's scary. drama. I it's weird because, do you know what's great? It's weird reading like secondary school dilemmas as a 32 year old man. Oh, 100%. Because it makes me feel like, what are you man doing? Yeah, literally. Focus on your yeah. education. <laughs> do you know what I mean? What do you mean you s him off? Exactly. <laughs> You're in year 10. Hey, bro, chill out. Ah, oh, see, I don't have this approach. Cause I remember what the fuck I was doing in year 10. I remember what I was doing at 15, 14. I remember those times. So, as an adult, I'm not like, oh, like, focus on your school. I'm like, for sure, focus on your school. But, like, they're dealing with the shit that they're dealing with. Like, let's address it as it should be addressed and not act like that's not the shit that's going on, especially at that time period. Cause especially in America, like, I don't know if it's still set up like that, but if you're 15 and you can take fucking driver's ed for a fucking course, so by the time next semester starts, you actually have your driver's license, you got a car lined up for yourself, Things are different. You you get to you get to live in a different fucking stratosphere in high school. It's different. So this is why I'm like ah like it'd be best to give more direct advice outside of just focus on your school because like ah it's hard to focus when the little homie says he 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 likes shorty over here but he don't know how to talk to her. How about we help him with that so he can focus on his school and have a good approach. That's all I'm saying. Yo, oh. out, bro. <laughs> but if I was a 15 year old you, wow. wow, that's my dream. 110%. That is my dream. Do you think for a second, bearing in mind, I barely care what she looks like. Yeah, yeah. If one of the black girls in school was gripped in my hands and squeezed my ass, I'm squeezing I'm, it. It's fitting yeah, through it the would, gap. Yeah, it would fold through my fingers. It would fold through I'm all the gap. I'm squeezing it. And then she can run around and tell us she wants. She can say what she wants. I say you forced me. Facts, bro. But yeah, um, that whole the whole optics of it is is nuts. Yeah, it's fing crazy. Um, but no, just cut her off, bro. She sounds toxic. Yeah, she sounds she's gonna get you in trouble, bro. Yeah, she's gonna get and if she finds out that you brizzed up my man, yeah, she's gonna uh, run him after everyone. Facts. So yeah, you, you need to cut her off. Keep that close and cut her off, man. Um yeah. and anyway, Protect guys, we're gonna lock it there. Media. Thank you very, very, very much. That was a ping episode That's and uh, love, love, love as always. Yeah, yeah, gang. Bye.
Uh, yeah, that was it. That was that took a crazy turn. That was a roller coaster right there. But yeah, that's it for this one. Thank you guys for joining me. If you could please hit that like, subscribe, Patreons in the description. And I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm at it. Peace.